Hi everyone, I know it's been a long while since I made a video. I apologize for that, but I have been crazy busy with homeschooling our daughter. But anyways, I wanted to talk to you about this Black Series HQ19. This thing is awesome. Ours is a lot bigger, of course, and it's uh, a lot more accommodating as far as space, uh, especially when you have kids. And I mean, we took this out to the beach several times, uh, out by the water, beautiful views several several times and i told my husband it's so much easier taking this versus our large fifth wheel don't get me wrong i love the fifth wheel but this black series was awesome i was a little apprehensive at first because of the size you know it is it is smaller compared to our fifth wheel but the windows in this and the uh, amenities that it does have it i mean i just fell in love with it i told my husband let's take it out again let's let's go out there and let's, let's take it to the beach and that's not really like me to want to go to the beach as often but yes this thing is beautiful it's an off-road camper it's made to go off-road and to go on the beach um, you know I mean it, it's just amazing I, I, I was very very impressed with this they're around 96 grand but you can buy them for you know a lot less but they are worth it beautiful beautiful and the tires even I mean I know I'm a female but it looks beefy it looks sporty it comes with two full-size spare tires which is pretty awesome it's got these red bars that protect the camper in case if you hit some rocks or you know some sort of terrain and it protects the camper which I thought that was pretty cool and I mean just the look of it like I said it looks sporty it looks beefy I, I like it it looks classy at the same time and told my husband we should actually get one just to kind of pick up and go really quickly versus having to hook up that giant fifth wheel. We can use a fifth wheel, but this one is a lot easier. And it's, it's actually really fun to go in there and just enjoy the outdoors, open up these large windows. As I was panning around, I'm sure you, know, you saw all these beautiful windows. You just open them up and it, the breeze just flows right through and you get a beautiful view from wherever you're at. So this beautiful camper comes with an outdoor kitchen. So you get your grill here. This connects to your propane on your RV and it has a little outdoor sink. It comes with a drawer here for all of your utensils, whatever you may need while you're cooking outside. And it does have a large countertop here, a counter space. So I really like this. This is really awesome. And we put this to use several times. So as you're walking in, there's a little button right here and it extends out these little steps right here. So the only thing that I did have a little complaint about, I wish that this had a removable mat right here. Um, you go to the beach, as you can see, there's still some sand and I've vacuumed and cleaned, but as you'd get out and in, in and out of this camper, of course, you scrape your feet off here so you can scrape off any sand, but it's not removable. So you can't actually shake it all off or if it, there's mud on it. So that was the only thing. If they could have this to where you can remove it, that would be great. So it comes equipped, of course, with your uh, fire extinguisher. And this thing is really, really high tech. Um, it took us a while to find the radio, but we ended up finding it. It was, it's really cool. So you have this drawer right here as soon as you walk in. And then of course this little drawer opens and it actually goes into this little tiny spot that is also leading to the outdoor kitchen drawer. And this bed here, uh, look at that. This was awesome. I mean, just look at the window here on this side of it. And then you have your window here. So, I mean, this is so cool. I sat there and I, you know, read a book. It was really, really cool. So the breeze does go in between. So very, very fresh. You don't even have to run the AC in this. There's a couple of little uh, closets right over on that side, as well as on this side over here to the right. Very comfy bed, um, a little on the firm side, but that's okay. But um, it's a little heavy, but it the bed does flip up. There's some controls down under the bed now the speaker system on this thing is great. So you have your outdoor speakers as well as you have your indoor speakers. So you have 
your drawers so you push it and then they open so they're nice deep and they actually extend completely out I mean you're not having to reach towards the back so you push them and they close pretty easy so with as much space as this has as far as uh, cabinets and drawers we really didn't even take up much because I mean we can just pick up and go and it was so easy so you have this little shelving here and the same thing you just kind of push it so a lot of space and then you flip this then you have even more space here so then here you have this one here yes yeah, so it's got a lot of space um really really cool and there we go so you got three large cabinets up here then you have your sink right here a lot of counter space here um, then you have your little area right here, which I like. And let's see here. You've got your little three burner stove right here and your little oven. So, and we actually did use the oven, so everything worked great in here. You have this really cool shelf in here where um, it actually pulls out. So you can slide this out. You can slide that out right here for your spices or whatnot. And it pops into place right there, just, you know, so it's not moving around and sliding out. You have this nice table here with um, the option of turning it into, I guess, like a little twin size. So the table drops down, then you pull the uh, cushions down. Very, very comfy. And then you have all this beautiful big window here. So when you open these windows, you get a lot of breeze coming in and out. Then you have your refrigerator right here. It's a nice size refrigerator. I like that they finished it off with sort of like a wood looking. So that's really nice. You got the little freezer. You have your freezer here. And then you have your microwave up here. Really tiny microwave, but hey, it does the trick what you need. I prefer convection only because it's just a little bit more uh, efficient. Now your, uh, your little dinette area comes with the little TV here on the corner. And then you have all these cabinets up here on the top. And this is the main brain of this. So look at that. So cool. Now I honestly really didn't mess with any of this. It was a uh, a little overwhelming for me but my husband did that so JD did this so you can look at his video and I'm sure he kind of played with some of those buttons here's another little storage space up here so you can have some more storage space in there you can use that but yeah overall this camper is awesome so as you walk in here into the bathroom so it's fairly large so just to kind of show you you know you have plenty of room you have your toilet over here on this side and it's porcelain then you have your tower holder here and it also has another little window up here on the top so that's pretty cool then you have your storage up here on the top so you have a lot of storage can't mention it of how much uh, you know it's so cool that this has that much storage now this is pretty cool so you lift this up and then you have your little washer but this is really cool having this in here so I thought that was pretty neat I didn't get to use it though um, I mean we were just taking it out on like day trips or I would just kind of just prefer to take my laundry home and just do it all at once versus you know using up the generator or using up the batteries to use that but nice deep sink here and it's porcelain beautiful finish right here and it comes with two little stationary cups for you know toothbrush or whatever it is that you want to put there and it comes with the already installed mirror here now the shower is really nice as well so the shower pretty big we had no problems using this shower and I love this right here because you can easily move it it's easy when you're bathing you know the baby or if you just want to rinse your feet off really quick then that's good it works great and you have your little fan up here and the door it slides so this slides around 
on this little truck. So there you go. And it's really easy. It doesn't catch. So that's really cool. I was afraid that it was going to give me an issue sliding, but it slides very, very easy. Look at that. Really, really nice camper. Can't say how much I love this thing. And now this door, it, uh, it slides closed. So you still have a lot of room here. So when you close it, you know, I'm going to stand in the shower so you can see how much space you have. And you still have room to come out of the shower and you have all of this space here to still stand here and get dressed. Really cool. A lot of cabinet space here. You got your drawers here. So you got three drawers and then you have your little bit of counter space there and on the bottom some shampoo or some extra toilet tissue. I usually put toilet tissue or things like that in drawers just to save space. But this is so cool. Then you just slide it over so that saves a lot of space. You don't have it swinging out. But overall this is a really cool camper guys. If you guys ever decide you want to get one of these or try one out they're amazing. The lighting in here is really cool too so you can do some kind of ambiance light it changes colors. Um, you know it's just really cool. I can't say you know there's not enough words on how great this camper is. I, I just loved it. A little too pricey for us right now but I really do. I mean maybe one day we can have one. But overall guys I really hope that you uh, enjoyed this video. Please comment and subscribe. Um, JD did make um, some other videos on this and so you can take a look at his channel and see if you can you know get a little bit more detail on it but overall I think this camper's great so again guys awesome black series HQ 19 it also has an awning up here on the top so that's really cool too the lighting around it too it gives you a lot of lighting when we went out to the beach it was really dark of course it gets dark at night and you're at the beach there's no lights out there but this thing is amazing there's lights all around it so it really lights up up here in the front it has all these LED lights throughout around all around it and really cool so I hope you like this video take a moment and subscribe and we'll be talking to you soon bye